I wanted to make a video about an interesting thing or a couple interesting things I noticed about the shift and rotate instructions, which includes the move instruction. Um, I made a blog post about uh, the move and logical shift left um, a little while ago, maybe a couple months ago, um, noting that they're basically the same instruction. It's just uh, the immediate five uh, bits are hard coded to zeros for the move, meaning that uh, the logical shift left kind of effectively uh, copies RM to RD, but also shifts however much you tell it to. So if you put zero, it doesn't shift at all, it effectively copies. So it's kind of an elegant way to have the same kind of machine encoding for both instructions. Um, so I mean, you know, not really uh, arguing against that method, that's actually kind of cool. Um, so let's take a look at all the instructions we see on the screen right now. Um, you'll notice that there is some similarities across all of them. Uh, first of all, you see the first field of three zero bits here. That's just saying that we're doing data instructions of uh, typically the register format, although these are kind of exceptions, these immediate ones here. Um, and, and really, if you look at the immediate format, which tends to be 001 for that field, you won't find those uh, shifts over in that area. Um, but anyway, so all these instructions have that in common. And then the next four bits, that field is supposed to define which actual instruction in that subcategory it's supposed to be. Um, an interesting thing is they're all identical here too. Um, but in this sense, they, they mean that they're kind of all the same sort of subcategory of uh, instructions. Um, so what really defines or, or makes uh, the instructions more distinct um, is this, this set of, uh, this, this field over here, the, this kind of looks like a three bit field, but really it's more of a two bit field. Um, you'll see for move and logical shift left, it's zero, zero. Um, you'll see for LSR, it's zero, one. You'll see ASR is one, zero. And then you see RRX and ROR are sharing uh, one, one. And those last two instructions are the ones I want to talk about. I, I was playing with them and I figured they might have a similar side effect as move and LSL. So looking at the RRX and ROR, you, you see the only difference in the whole thing is similar to move in LSL where in R, RRX, uh, what would be the immediate five bits of ROR, they're hard coded to zeros. So it's kind of like if you were to do an ROR with zero as your immediate value, that should be RRX. I mean, how could it not? That's, that's the only thing it could be, right? Um, so of course, I'm not just going to go with theory. I want to test it. I want to see what happens. This thing I do. Um, so let's uh, make an assembly program here. And I'm going to do a couple valid instructions. So ROR, R0, R0, media value 1. It's a valid one. R X R zero R zero, um, just just to see like what it's really supposed to be. I'm going to go ahead and assemble and link the file. Then I'm going to run obj dump, and you see exactly what we typed in assembly there. You got your R O R with immediate shift of one. You got R R X. Looks pretty normal. Um, so let's uh, do our little thing that we wanted to do. See if our R O R of an immediate value of zero will look like RRX. So I'm going to go ahead and save that. I'm going to reassemble it and relink it. And let's dump it. So that's weird, right? Um, we have move R0, R0. Um, if we go over here, this is the register format of it. It, it does the zero, 00 type. We completely escaped this 1, 1 type and ended up doing uh, a move register with uh, R0, R0, you know, as for arguments here, which would effectively be copying R0 to R0, which really does nothing, which is why it's showing up as not here, but with a comment of what the actual encoding would make it be. Um, and really, I'm going to go back in here and type that assembly out just to show that it really is the same. So R0, R0, and put a symbol link it and dump it. And you see machine code here is identical. For whatever reason, let me go 
back to our program here. For whatever reason, these two instructions, machine code wise, are identical, even though, I mean, which is, that's not unexpected. Usually there's, there's good reasons for those kind of things. Um, but my expectation would be this instruction would be identical with this one, not this bizarre fucking no-op. But just thought I would share that with you guys.